Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. Uh, we're not going to sit here too long and talk about everything, but we wanted to catch you up on um, what we've been doing for the last three weeks. Well, it's official. I am retired. Um, doesn't quite feel that way yet because we're up north by Michelle's dad visiting family, so it's kind of like a vacation. Um, but it's been a couple days. We've been able to relax and get some stuff done as we uh, moved out of our old campground to up here. Um, but uh, I'm sure after a couple weeks, things will set in for me. So if you guys haven't noticed yet, um, we did change our name to Camper Vibes. So the reason we changed our name is we know we're not the first people to try to live in a RV full time and travel or anything like that, but we kind of wanted to narrow down our focus of what we're trying to do. And what we want to do is inspire people. Um, whether it's inspiring people to start a business, to start a nonprofit, to work less, to experience more, that's kind of what we want to do. We, we still have plans to work occasionally, um, but the thing that I noticed over the month and a half while I was still working even full time was that this lifestyle causes you to slow down, to uh, experience more. You don't have the yard work, the housework, all that kind of stuff. So my days off, even though most of them were really busy, uh, we still find time to eat as a family, to go on walks, to play badminton, to go swimming, have bonfires, you know, that kind of stuff that you don't, yes, you get a chance to do it when you're working 40 plus hours a week, but not as much. And it just forces you to take a step back. I think when you're busy working, you know, you only get a couple days off, if that. So then you're rushing and you're tired and you don't, you're not in the mood to do things. So. We've really noticed a difference um, just in the past, you know, month that we've been staying at the campground. Yeah, it's it, it really is uh, eye-opening the amount of time that gets wasted um, when you have a house and that. So what what our what our thought was is that you know let's not be try to be the first to do something. Let's just inspire people, and like I said, whether it's to to work less and have less to experience more, to start your own business, to, to make a change in your life so that you can be with family, enjoy family, enjoy your kids, enjoy your time as husband and wife. Um, we just wanted to make that change. And so with Camper Vibes, we're hoping that that kind of, you know, we set the vibe for changing your lifestyle. Yeah, for us, it was really scary. I mean, a lot of people ask, aren't you scared that you're not gonna have that good job, you know, that pays really well? And, you know, we were, but we're more excited for the things that can potentially come our way, you know, and we're opening those doors. So at our old campground, um, we met lots of new people. <laughs> um, first time RVers, you know, that been into it a year. Um, people that have RVed for quite some time. Um, just everybody was really friendly. Our, fr our kids have met new friends. Um, they didn't even want to leave. That you know they want to go back there still. They became really close and had lots of fun. Um, the, our neighbor would bring donuts and food and goodies, you know, and then we'd go over there and have campfires with them. So that was a lot of fun um, meeting new people already. So yeah, with the name change, this is what it's all about, is inspiring people to make a change in their life and meeting new people, getting out there and experiencing new things and seeing new places. And, and that's really what we're gonna try to relay to you guys. I mean, if something big happens or we have something that we wanna really talk to you about, we'll talk to you about it, but it's gonna be more of that inspiration to try to you know, see how much fun you can have while working less with less and experiencing more. Uh, the last thing we want to mention is that um, we have a friend up here, my dad's neighbor, talked to her aunt and her aunt and husband had a piece of land out here and they were kind enough to let us stay here for the whole month. Little or nothing. Um, yeah, it's got 50 amp hookup, uh, they've got water, sewer, everything, so. And we also have better receptions, but that's why we haven't been able to put a video out there the last three weeks because we had no reception whatsoever at the campground. Um, where we were staying. 
So Camper Vibes is officially the new thing for us. Uh, the website is camper-vibes.com. Um, I will have a link in Tin Canville to forward you to the new website. Uh, we're still gonna be working on the website, um, changing fonts and colors and all that kind of stuff, but it's up and running, so check it out. Uh, all the social media stuff has been changed. The links are down below in the description, so check them out. Perfect, thank you. Checking in from the Duluth Air Show in Minnesota. Checking out the Navy uh, Blue Angels. What is that? Anthem.
picture with them? Of course. 